gallery because we have a beautiful painting here. This is simply fantastic. You have witnessed history! by Blackwood as Burrow sends it to Duclair on a breakaway! Score! Anthony Duclair comes back to New York and puts the Sharks up one to nothing. Burrow makes a defensive play in his own zone. He locates Duclair in behind the defense, throws it out there. What a handle by Duclair. And this is the exact same move he used last night on the breakaway. Hall collects that puck, settles it down, and he gets it to the forehand. Simon Holstrom off the turnover. He's dangerous, has two short-handed goals, and he hits the crossbar and in! And that will tie him with Logan O'Connor for the NHL lead, short-handed! He intercepts the puck, a little tic-tac given goal with J.G. Pajot, and Holstrom comes in on the backhand. This is a beauty up over the shoulder. And a breakaway. Oh, boy. And a... And a... What a pass by Marty Natchez to Stefan Nason. Unselfish, probably could have went backhand shell. Just drop it, just take a tap in by Lightning. And the little chip from Nason to make sure that Comrie doesn't make a spectacular low save. But you think about Natchez, hasn't scored in some time. He could have taken that to the house. Completely unselfish. Un especially when you consider the circumstance tonight. Keller looking around, Keller right through, they score, what a pass! Look at the silky mitts of number nine, head up, little saucer pass, up and down, over two, if not three, Washington Capitals sticks, and right onto the twig of Logan Cooley, thank you very much, backdoor tap in, and he's pointing at Clayton Keller. Out the left, Renier, saved by Husso, he's in just a real good job by BC to get a stick on it. I think it's good, Jody. It's below the crossbar. I'm on that one and then two. It's almost like a trick goal there for BC. The hand-eye coordination and the wherewithal in slow motion, you can appreciate it. As you're right, that's at the crossbar or below, and that's a good goal. What a goal for the Rangers. What a finish for BC. Back to Middleton. A penalty coming against Nashville. Middleton scores! A backhander that goes pop shelf. Polino with the feed to Middleton. Joining the rush late. Beautiful play here to the backhand. Wide base. Quick little flip. He's got that big paddle. Rolls it off the heel to the toe. Snaps it over the glove of Saros. He's had a lot of them here. Now more spinning, shooting. Oh! And he scores! There was absolutely no space. Oh, yes, there was. Spin, he's going there just as his hands get in front of the red line. He releases. There's no wasted time. There's no hesitation. It's skill. It's power. Bruno got it to Lisa. Got it to the front of the net. Between his legs, it I mean, he's, it he's facing the wrong way. Leeson is just going to throw this at the net. Now watch the hand eye. He's going to spin back between his legs. What a goal! First of the year for Brock McGinn. That is a big one for Anaheim. On for Robbie Patrick. Who had a goal last oh. night. Nice move there. Patrick right in a goal. Oh, he scores! What a play! What a play. My goodness, that's a good example of playing the puck and not the body. And Robbie Fabry made him pay. Did he undress him or what? As I look at the big board, there's a jock strap hanging on it, and it belongs to Kaiser. Oh, my. Jari, he's going for the empty net! Bouncing towards the goal! He scores! You have witnessed history! Tristan Jari becomes the first goaltender in Pittsburgh Penguins history to actually score a goal! Wow, was that with some authority, too? I mean, that thing was sky down the ice. I'll tell you what, that puck bounces the first time on the hash marks. There's not many goaltenders that can do that. Pasternak, a wiggle, and Zaka scores! Pasternak's ability to freeze defenders is paralyzing to an opponent. Nice little move to the outside. San Jose doesn't defend the middle ice. And it's basically just a simple give and go. Get to the back end where I got tons of leverage. Throw it up over the left pad and glove. And that's a nice finish by Zaka. With the Blues for 10. Here's a quick shot. Scores! Benson right off the face off. Rips it low and pass Bennington. Cousins wins this draw. Benson gets it here bang he just spins fires it to the net leaves it right on the ice it was perfectly placed the quick shot and the smile on that young man right there he knows that's a big goal here's Bramlin the one-timer they score 
What a pass by Granlin over the defenseman. Duclair just a quick one-time shot and buries it on Schmidt. But Zetterlin really sets this up on the physical play deep inside the defensive zone. Oh, you talk about a guy who needed a goal. It's Anthony Duclair. And a pass for Duclair. He scores! The Duke is loose! What a move by Duclair. Cutting over to his backhand and back to the forehand. And buries on a beautiful little move, second of the night. And second, huge assist for Mikhail Grandlin. And that was perfection. The pass, the deke, and then the finish by Anthony Duclair. Velarde. Interesting to see how when he settles in, he is on the power play, and he sets up simply. Look at Velarde as he protects it, uses his big body. That's just slick mix. It's like the puck is a yo-yo off of his blade. He can string it out and suck it back in, and he did right there. A little one-touch pass. Good for Scheifele to go to the puck, and then he doesn't dust it off top corner. Who came to Toronto as the villain? Sticks the stake in the Leafs heart. Pasternak went on the low. He tried to go five hole on the back end. When it wasn't there, he did not curl away. Marshawn able to slump it down. What an effort by Boston. Drives it around the net. Drops it back to Stone and scores. Doesn't get much better than that. Eichel's going to curl and has everybody falling out low. No look backhand pass and stole from a tough angle to the back of the net as the captain gets his seventh off an incredible feed from Michael. Islanders power play brought to you by your Tri State Volkswagen dealers. Lee scores! Tapped in through the legs of Anders Lee and Anthony Stolars. Well, you talk about the importance of faceoffs and you never underestimate the value of that. It gives you see this faceoff. Good win. Lots of puck movement as Anders Lee stays right in front. Quick pass. I love the play by Anders Lee. But Smith comes up with it. Got Sissons with him. Finds him. Tip score! That's Yakov turning right in front. Redirects it in for a 2 0 lead. Sisson just gets this puck. There's no bones about it right here. He's going to get this puck back. Cole Smith's going to get it to him. Great to the net. Trenton's right in front of Lucan and he tips it again. Tough play there for Lucan and he's had two goals and not much of a chance on either. Ewers takes it, drops it back. Shifley to Connor. To Shifley centering pass. Ewers top shot goal. The movement of this puck goes to Connor Ehlers between the legs to Shifley. Oh yeah, I'll just drop it back to Connor, back to Shifley. And Ehlers does such a great job here. Rather than rushing towards the net, he paces himself back to the high slot where there is no coverage. He gets it on and off the stick in a hurry with great accuracy. That is a thing of beauty. Toledo in for Minnesota, cuts through a slot off the post. While slamming their sticks on the wall, they think that Polino shot found the back of the net. What a move by Marcus Polino to get inside the paint. That did look to me like it hit the back of the net up here from the press box. That hit just to the back bar there and caught the padding. That's why it didn't make a sound like a ping. Oh, it hit the post first, then the middle part. Man, he really got a lot of wood on that. Puck still in play. Larkin shot. Score! Holy shnikes! What a shot from Larkin! That puck might have been airborne when he ripped it. Puck pops out to Larkin. And he absolutely fires this one one time. You see him go down to that one knee, get the leverage. But Buffalo definitely stops. Thinks there should be a whistle. There isn't. And it's in the back of their net. And alone to Skinner. Back in. Score! Detroit does a great job cutting this ice in half. Keeping Buffalo on the right side. But Tage Thompson back in the lineup. Great job protecting it. And these are the battles Buffalo has to win. They did it on their last goal. They continue to do it here. Skinner comes up with that puck. What a move to his backhand. And it's a big power.